Burger Rippy over here at the 369 Iron Ranch Wednesday morning early. Somebody out for a little cruise in the airplane this morning. So usually my bad weather comes from this direction and you can see there's bad clouds but the clouds have been going the other way from here. I've had a hard time predicting my weather out here. Yeah, the from the southwest all the bad weather hits and then now it's it's doing a circle kind of a thing. The uh I'm out by my row of sunflowers have germinated. I have successful germination of the sunflowers. This one here, um, a red winged blackbird had one for a snack, which I have plenty to share. I have a lot of mixed hay here, done beautifully. Absolutely gorgeous. One record day after another of high temperatures. Quick look at the California poppies. You can see how uh, a lot of them have lost their petals. Part of things because I have the camera out. We're going back to the pond, but I'm going to go shopping. The Aldi's over at Kyleville, and they don't open until nine o'clock. We'll see what we can get into today, and I'll let you know here in a minute uh, about the channel. Uh, yeah, just absolutely gorgeous day. Um, the the parts are coming for the push mower. This one here blew a belt last night. I, I already replaced it. I was out here at 9 o'clock. Um, we have daylight working hours from 6 in the morning till 9 at night. And uh, I was getting finished, and it turns out this belt was war. And uh, I showed you guys one like that the other day. It was last year on the red one, and I'm st it's still on there, the mule drive. And I had to replace them on hand, and got on the eBay and order, ordered a few more replacements because uh, for years to come and these I've bought four of these these wear out these idler pulleys this one happens to be plastic they're about 15 bucks a piece and I used metal and plastic and the bearing just melted all of a sudden smoke just ro roared up that was on the red one the bearings locked up the sealed ball bearing locked up spun in the plastic and yeah and that's uh this belt wore so um it was sloppy and it ended up it fell off and then this is where it wore before i got it shut down <clears throat> uh, i noticed wonder hussey went to the iowa 80 at walcott the world's largest truck stop i've been going there my whole life uh, something wasn't right with her that day and uh, they even spent the night and afterwards she left Barry and said he was a nice guy but he was odd and, and you know she's not perfect either but something happened in that trip where she's a woman that walks 20 miles uh, on hikes and things and she just barely made it around the Walcott she didn't even make it upstairs which uh, Pam on a lamb did a video there and she did a load of uh, laundry while she was there and stuff it, Sarah didn't make her way around the facility the facility was closed the museum wise and they were set to open the 21st which was I think last Thursday uh, so the Walcott 80 museums open now they redid their website I've been watching because I was going to make a special trip out there just to go to the museum this summer I've been wanting to do it I watched them build the whole thing the whole truck stop through my lifetime and I've been to several of the jamborees Sarah compared it to Burning Man which it's not by a long shot and uh, the Burning Man would kind of be the, the, the mats in Louisville the Louisville truck show would be the Burning Man if there was one it, it is a good show and I was going to go I think during the show but I, uh, going uh, not during the show would be okay too and the show's only three days anyway but this year they're going to somehow try to do a virtual um, I was going to say Louisville truck show a virtual Walmart, Walcott I, Iowa 80 
Walcott Iowa 80 Truckers Jamboree, they call it. It's the 44th annual one, I think, or 41st. I'm not sure, but they're going to do it virtually. So that's why I'm out on my channel. Uh, I'm out here, boots on the ground, working on this stuff. And we're going to find a way on the channel. I've run the channel long enough to where I, I know what it takes to run it and to produce a couple videos a day. But I've never seen this before, and uh, would still like to make it. It's uh, Wolcott's 500 miles each way from Columbus, Ohio. So my trip to Iowa was going to be a, a I, I don't know. It's just it's not happening, man. It doesn't exist, and I've never seen can uh, festivals canceled. But this is a website here, and I have people ask me all the time. Used to and. How do you find out about where to go? And for two years, I've I've used I said I Google it. And you don't cancel a festival ever. And here's a big COVID warning. I mean, I'm so anxious to put this behind us. But this one's virtual. And I mean, a lot of these places, if you, uh, every day they open up, they lose money, which is anti-business. But canceled, canceled. That's this weekend. Through the month of June, everything's canceled. And then into July, everything's canceled. And even into August. There's the end of June, and and into July, the 4th of July, my favorite holiday of the year, I mean, you would never see one of them canceled. Uh, Yellow Springs, um, I had to take down my video on the comedian guy's house, only 400 people watched it anyway. Um, yeah, I had a complaint on a video. I, I've been trolled. Uh, I, I think it was a, uh, a anti rippy hate group attack. And, uh, yeah. Uh, just a click of a button fixes that stuff. Here's the Mechanicsburg Town Party for the 4th of July. It's a week late. And, uh, but what's been happening is the ones that aren't canceled. It gets right up at the last minute and then it goes red and that's what happened to Saturday I had the car show lined up or, or no it was Monday I'm sorry because of the holiday and there at the last minute it went red and my brother still went I never talked to him about I bet you he had a good time too but they did cancel the show and I do not want to get sick by any uh, means of the imagination uh, so uh, I've never seen a, a festival canceled and they cancel all my festivals and I, I'm not sure which way the channel will go but uh, it, um, Yeah, I, I've dealt with bigger bigger and better fish to fry here. That's why I need to order some more blades here. I've, I've been a couple blades and uh, The crops are going in big time as you can see I'm gonna have a beautiful row of sunflowers there it looks and uh have a great germination and uh, just uh, really enjoying the summertime and these uh, hot temperatures man it, it's, it's freaking awesome out here thanks for watching everyone for guard rippy but yo uh, doesn't look like they're gonna have a Wolcott Iowa 80 Jamboree this year and uh, the whole summer is kind of canceled so it's gonna be an alternative summer somehow thanks for watching stay healthy for guard rippy here with Harlow. Harlow, because I got the camera, that means we're going to go back to the pond. Ah! <laughs>